Hi, this is Justice with Tablet Pro. In this video, I'm going to show you something I'm really excited about. Uh, we have a new feature coming to version 3 of Tablet Pro, which I'm hoping we can release in December. That's the goal. So I'm going to go ahead and jump right in and show you the new mini editor. All right, so here is, this is the default artist pad. I'm going to tap on the word default. And now this is going to turn all of the buttons on the artist pad red. So let's say we want uh, this little arrow button here. We want this, you can see that it's populated the icon here. We want this to click a location on the screen. So then we're going to go, uh, let's go right here. Okay, and we click apply. Now here, you can see that this is jumped. Uh, let's go ahead and open up the settings here. I'm going to turn on a feature. All right, we're gonna do track line, presentation, that's fine. Okay, so then when we go here and we click this button, you can see it makes this arrow jump over here. Pew. How fun. All right, let's do a different button. Uh, let's go pick button and let's choose the assist pad button. You can see it populates action type assist pad. Here's the list right here. So we want to change this to a hotkey. We want it to be uh, win plus D. So we're going to select D. You can use the keyboard here as well. Win plus D, click apply. And now when we press this, you can see win plus D is being sent. So if we had uh, a program up, we could press it, win plus D, yay. Okay, now here, these are really cool. These are a really big deal because in OneNote and other programs when you're mapping a location, it was a pain in the butt to go through that process. So now it can be done really easily. And we're working on getting it set up so you can just go drag to location, drag to location, drag to location, drag to location, and map like four or five in about 10 seconds. Uh, and we'll get there, we're, we're close. Okay, now here's the next thing. This is really cool. Search icon, let's say we want up arrow. Now we have a couple options. So we've selected the up arrow and we click apply. Now we have something different here. Pretty cool. All right. Square. Square. And we're going to put it back and click apply. And this is actually a different one. Let's try that one. All right, I'll have to find the other one. <laughs> so from here, you can go into the extended layout editor, uh, but you can pick these different things. You can open up the font awesome website. This opens up directly to the icons you can choose from. So you can use this to do a more extensive search. This is set for version 5.1, 5.4. Uh, let's open up the mini editor one more time. All right, and let's say we want this. We're going to make this uh, arrow key again. We want it to go to the right. Okay, that's good. Um, here's the tooltip. Right. Go. Okay, now we should have tooltip and it should send right and it does that. Woo -hoo! This is a really big deal. Uh, I think it's really cool. You can change the button text name right here as well. Um, and cancel, it doesn't do anything yet. <laughs> but you get the idea. All right, you guys, um, version three is coming. Uh, any licenses that are purchased uh, right now? will go towards version three as well. And I have a 75% discount on the website, tabletpro.com slash install. So check that out, purchase it today before the discount is gone. All right, thanks for watching. Until next time, stay creative and have a wonderful day.